one and one. This is Mike Colleen at MikeColleen.com. Your dating and relationship expert and your communication expert. Okay, today we're going to talk about how men receive emotional fulfillment. Uh, obviously, the course is to teach men how to give women emotional fulfillment. But ladies, I thought you might be interested uh, in understanding how does he receive emotional fulfillment. Now, you're doing, you're making the same mistake he is. You're assuming, well, the same way I do. Uh huh. Men receive emotional fulfillment in the complete opposite way that you receive emotional fulfillment. And so when he receives emotional fulfillment, he makes the same assumption. Well, she art, she does the same way I do. Therefore, she's feeling this amazing feeling inside. No, she doesn't. And this is where we are missing once again in our dating relationships and marriages. Emotional fulfillment is the core of my course. It is everything my course leads up to and what it's all about. Because men, if a woman, if a if a woman does not receive deep emotionally fulfilling connections through communication, she's she will no matter what you buy her. I, seriously, you could literally buy her a brand new Ferrari. You could buy her a million dollar diamond ring. I promise you, she'll not. She's not going to feel good. She's not going to feel loved by you. Sure, she's going to be happy as hell when she sees that Ferrari or that million dollar home or whatever. But that is not love to a woman, and that's something men like. Well, she looks happy, but that's only temporary. And a lot of you rich guys or a lot of you men who worked your ass off to make house payment after house payment after house payment, diamond ring payment after diamond ring. And next thing you know, she leaves you. She's mad and angry all the time. You're like, and she's like, you don't love me. Well, this is why. Emotional fulfillment, okay? Watch this. This shocks a lot of people, especially women. So the way a man receives emotional fulfillment is the opposite of the way a woman does. Now, how does a woman receive emotional fulfillment? Through right brain communication, the internal language. First, it's mentally stimulating communication, so number one. And then once that lockbox is full, it pops open, and she opens up emotionally to to hopefully receive, which men don't do, and women will testify to this, right brain internal emotionally fulfilling communication. That is what my course is for men. It teaches them how to give you emotional fulfillment. Now, here's, and that's the number one reason why men don't give you emotional fulfillment. Uh, is because they don't speak this language. But watch this. Here's another sneaky thing um, that <clears throat> men and women make a mistake. So as a woman, you make an assumption that, well, he understands emotional fulfillment. No, he doesn't. And he receives emotional fulfillment the same way I do. No, he doesn't. The way a man receives emotional fulfillment, believe it or not, the, way, the doorway to a man's heart is his groin. I know you think I'm joking. I'm not. Watch this. After a man has an orgasm through sex, there's a chemical called oxytocin that's released into his bloodstream, pumped through his heart, and pumped through his whole body. Now, oxytocin acts as a relaxant for a man. But for a woman, it acts as a mental stimulant. So here's how a woman receives uh, uh, oxytocin into her bloodstream. Through talking. Through mentally stimulating conversations and communication. Now, I remember as a kid, my dad said, oh, no, no, Michael, don't, don't ask you because my stepmom. He goes, don't ask her questions. I'm like, well, why? Michael, once she starts talking, she won't stop. And I go, well, shut up, Dad. And he goes, no, no, Michael, I'm not kidding. Please, please don't. Because he was in a relaxed mood, right? And so over the years, I started talking to one brother. I was like, oh, yeah, the minute we start talking, we can't stop. And, and she goes, is that what is it? She goes, yeah, that drug gets in your brain, and it stimulates your nerves and your neurons and your electrons, and everything just starts freaking, you know, getting fired up because that, that oxytocin acts as a caffeine high to your brain, and it makes you want to talk and talk and talk, and it makes conversations fun. Now, so for men... Oxytocin, again, is released through sex having an orgasm. It gets pumped into a system, but it acts as a relaxant, like a drug. So for men, it, it relaxes every nerve, every fiber, every nerve ending, every cell, and he's just like, oh. The last thing he wants to do is talk. And I know his women are like, oh, God, it's true. Men don't like to talk after sex. The reason being is because if he starts talking, by default, he will revert back to his left brain, his logical processor. And the reason why men have sex is they're stuck here in the, all day long working and pushing and working, and they just want to relax. And after sex, they can finally have that feeling. And I call that fi- fi- that feeling for men, he would probably say, I just feel relaxed and content. Okay? So here's scientifically what happens. 
once it is pumped through his heart and pumped through his body, it relaxes every nerve, every fiber, every cell. Once it goes into his uh, brain, into the lower brain, there's an artery that's controlled in that lower brain or the reptilian uh, center, the reptilian brain. And once oxytocin hits that artery, it relaxes it. And that allows the blood to flow up into the larger human brain, especially his right brain. And thus it opens him up to his right brain and he's feeling emotions. He's feeling love. And thus he's receiving emotional fulfillment. So men receive emotional fulfillment through sex. That's the difference between how men and women receive emotional fulfillment. And this causes a huge miss because he makes a horrible assumption. Oh, I love you, babe. I feel so good. He assumes, just like you did, about him receiving most fulfillment, he assumes that you receive this same wonderful feeling after sex the way he does. Guys, she has to go one, and then it goes down two. It literally is wired this way. She can't go up. It can't go from the groin up to the heart for her. It doesn't work. This is why women say that sex alone is meaningless. She's not getting that same feeling after sex that you get of just feeling totally relaxed and content. And that's what a woman wants in a relationship, but it has to be done first through communication. Hey, this is Mike Colleen at MikeColleen.com. If you truly want to save your marriage or meet the girl of your dreams, trust me, guys, if you learn how to give a woman emotional fulfillment and you're single, you won't be single anymore. Right now, the month of January, and I'm probably because Valentine's Day is coming up, I am going to give you guys all men's books and women's books, okay? I'm giving you a 20% discount. Even if they're already discounted, you're going to get 20% more off. All you have to do, do is use one word, caveman, because this is my caveman month. I'm eating, doing the paleo diet now. I'm, I'm hiking and running hills right now. I'm getting back in shape. It's cold outside. That's why I do the whole caveman thing, get tough. So remember, all you have to do is pick out the books that you want, any and all, all books. It doesn't matter. And it's also for my ultimate package as well. Once you upload it, add it to cart, there's going to be a little an upper right hand corner, there's going to be a discount box. Put the word, one word, caveman, in that box, and I think you you enter whatever is the button you push, and it'll automatically delete the 20% off, and you get to buy it, whatever you want. Hey, go to Mike Colleen, M I K E K O L L I M. I'm sorry, Mike Colleen, M I K E. K-O-L-L-I-N dot com and get your caveman month on and for happy Valentine's I hope you guys have fun. Oh remember, the number one day of divorce or people filing for divorce or or talk or getting a divorce is the day after Valentine's. So you better buy those books. See you soon. Bye.